And now a message from the city of New York. We've all been there. Oh no. Oh no, oh no. You've been hacked. You've been hacked. Bank account at zero, zero, zero. So you've been hacked. Look familiar? Of course it does. It's the year 2024 and we're losing the war against hackers. They now own 80% of our monies and everything west of the Hudson. And that's because hackers are super, super smart. And even though New Yorkers are the most overeducated people in the country, we are no match for hackers. I have a degree from Colombia. You've been hacked. You've been hacked. Bank account at zero, zero, zero. Hacked again? Shucks. It's time to turn the table on these hackers. And that's why here at the City of New York, we've developed this over 1,000 page guide to outwitting hackers. Here are just a few of our many, many tips, including tip number one. You wouldn't hack a little baby, would you? I've been hacked 186 times. We know hackers can see into our homes. So let's convince them that we're defenseless, penniless little babies. Repeat after me, New York. I'm a little, little baby and I wish you wouldn't act my way. Studies have shown that the more method you can go with this, the less likely you are to be hacked. So truly become a baby. Drool, roll around on the ground. Don't even go to the bathroom yourself. I'm a little bitty baby. Is it working? Well, we certainly hope so because we've printed over one million copies of this guide. I've been acting and dressing like a baby for the past 16 months. My girlfriend won't sleep in the same bed as me anymore, but uh, I have not been hacked. Number two, take advantage of the hacker's sense of decency. Make your password something that a hacker might be uncomfortable typing. For instance, type this. I can't write this. That's how you know it's a great password. This isn't a factual statement about this group of people. And especially as a white man, I cannot say this. Exactly. And if you need more examples of great passwords, just go to nyc.gov backslash offensive statements for passwords underscore final underscore V3. My boss found my password on a piece of paper in the trash. I spent the next two weeks at a retreat for bigots. Sounds like it was a great password. Nice job, Angeline. And if all that fails, our third tip is sure to keep you safe. Take advantage of a hacker's potential sense of empathy. Make your password perhaps a very sad story about your life so that the hacker feels very bad for you. Hackers are not known for their sense of empathy, so be sure to make your password very, very sad and very specific. When I was at Girl Scout camp late at night, all the girls were talking about the boys they wanted to hook up with. I said, Arthur, I didn't know he isn't real and I didn't know you can't hook up with a cartoon character. And even real aardvarks can't consent. Everyone laughed at me. Great password, Brenda. No one's ever going to take advantage of Brenda after hearing that incredibly sad, sad story. My password is that my husband left me for a frozen yogurt machine. It's painful to live through, but it makes for a great password. Mm. I turned my password into a best-selling novel. You can get it on Amazon for 99 cents. This has been a message from the city of New York. New York citizens are some of the smartest citizens in this whole US of A, and also are no match for hackers. So go ahead, be sad, be pathetic, be inconsiderate, be offensive, and hope that they go after your family. <laughs> I mean, oh. Oh, I buttoned my shirt wrong. Whoop, gotta start.
from the bottom. Button it up to the top. That's not right. Has my shirt been hacked? Is this hacking?